ACC team that reminds you of what the, they're going to show? Uh, they, no, but there's an SEC team that reminds you what they're going to show. I mean, they, 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 they remind you of Vanderbilt and they remind you of Georgia. I mean, very big, strong football players, good linebackers. I mean, uh, that's the cookie mode defense in the SEC. Do you get tired of the, all the SEC talk? Well, I, I, only because we're in the South. Right. I'm sure. It, I'm sure it's regional because right. they don't. They recruit in our backyard, and they all come and recruit. So, it's very common to run into the same recruiters as far as uh, the SEC teams recruiting against Georgia Tech and the schools. And obviously, the academics plays a part with us in Vanderbilt. And just it's just one of those deals. You run into those guys more than you run into any other one. Right. Would it be a statement to? to well, I, mean, I think. Uh, I I think that it's a, uh, you know, it, it'll be a. It'll be a vein run by the media and everything else, but really I think our kids and our guys' focus has all been to try to get that ninth win. I mean, the, the nine victories is a, is, a good, is a great number, and I think that's something that we'd like to achieve. Do you know who the most cup likes on the line? Uh, Parker Brown. Oh, really? Yes. Wow. He's, he didn't, I mean, he only started. <clears throat> there's a reason why he got the start, because yeah. when he was in there, he was very productive on getting people wow. on the ground. Do you know what the number was? Uh, he has 84 at this point. Who was that guy? Uh, Freddie, I believe. Uh, that's close, and then you got Andrew Marshall who's done a good job in there too. Right. So that those guys are kind of physical coming off the ball. Those three that have come to my mind. Yeah. How is eighty four as a number? For you? Uh, it, it, if it's not bad for a freshman, yeah. <laughs> and uh, in, and really for for us uh, as a whole, I, I would like to see more. Mm -hmm. But I think that uh, he'll get he'll do a better job as his technique develops a little bit better too, because very athletic, yeah. very very you know very uh, smooth in transition and change in direction. What's uh, Jay's early? What's kind of your hope for playing with him coming in? He still is. I mean, we, we, he, oh, yeah, actually, yeah. I mean, yeah. he played this year and he right. and he's gotten a game. He played in the last game. I mean, he's a guy that goes in there and we gets we get ten to ten ten to fifteen snaps out of him every game. So here, yeah. at least last part of the season, if he continues to practice well and and give us good practices as far as not many mental errors and then uh, also physical because it, it, the game's new to him too. I right. mean, he was a defensive lineman his whole entire career until. And Spot played some on the old line, but now he has to do it full time, and uh, he has a he has the body to do it, and he has the flexibility to do it, and he's going to be a good football player. But at this time, he's still young. He makes some of those um, young man errors.